Oh, these smell so good. Oh my gosh, smell that, how good that smells. Shallots? Mm. If you were my husband, what? you would have shoved that right in my face. I almost oh, fell for no. that. <laughs> so I was like, smell it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Electra Wiedemann, and there are a few things I love more than food and conversation. Join me as I bake, cook, and break bread with some of the most fascinating people I know. Today I'm at the Bedford Post Inn and I'm about to cook with Blake Lively. So what are we making today? It's a, it's a puff pastry and we're gonna wrap um, brie in it and we're gonna bake it. But inside it's gonna have a shallot confit and then like a fig raspberry compote with some balsamics. And, and then we might put a little bourbon maple syrup on top. So this is gonna be a little shaky because I, I don't ever cook with a recipe. So it's all just like, you That's know. That's fine. We're it's all a little about... wild. So what are these? Let's talk these about These are the those. balsamics. So one is blackberry, one is fig, one is black cherry, and then one is strawberry. And whenever I'm making desserts, I always like, I'll put it in like the icing or a little bit, because it's the same effect that like alcohol has when you're cooking. You know, it gives it like that, that rich, heavy base. It cuts the sweetness in a lot of things, you know, okay. in a nice way, and it gives it a nice depth. You are really well known for not ever having a stylist uh -huh. and just being able to like pick your own clothes, which is awesome, because that's something I totally cannot do, by the way. No way. But right now you're redecorating a home. Mm -hmm. You know, it's all the same concept. I dream of being re be able to retile a kitchen. I don't even know why. It's just yourself. Always, yeah, I, I just always want to be able to do that. My I sister always... did it to her bathroom, and it was like really impressive. How did it turn like, out? Louboutins and like retiling her bathroom. And, I don't that's know, pretty, I think it's pretty. That's just you know a day in the life of the lively family. <laughs> Whatever, no big deal. But you know what? I cooked it for say. What do you mean you cooked there? I mean, I cooked with a pastry chef. Oh my God, Ellen, amazing. And I went to go learn how to make their, their butterscotch. And they were like, oh, you really know what you're doing. Why don't you stay here for the evening? And you were like, yeah, I know what I'm doing. Yeah, but over the course of the evening, they saw I didn't know what I was doing. Like cooking butterscotch <laughs> is one thing. And then like sugar sculptures and like all this wow. other stuff was, was not my strong suit. So I'm just gonna put the, um, the brie in the center. These smell so good. I love this. That's so awesome. And then you cinch it with your fingers. You just squeeze it tight. OK, perfect. OK, so now I've heard you do a one-handed egg situation. Yes. OK, I, so I don't believe it. With the ball, you hit it flat. And then after you crack it, you want to like separate it. Like this, these fingers separate up. These fingers separate down. So it's a three-way finger separation. What? And then it spins back in the top. Now pull it apart. Oh! Look at I actually don't like the taste of alcohol, that's why I don't drink. Maybe. You don't like any alcohol at all? Uh-uh. Wine, beer, But nothing. I cook with so much alcohol. But but when I like like I like the rich, like velvety notes of it without that like medicinal kick. It was a big knife. Whoa! Alright, so can I'm gonna try I'm gonna try yeah. that bite. Yeah. It yeah. Right? Yeah, it's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> That's the problem. Thank you for watching Goodness with Electra. Yay! And, and happy. happy. <laughs> <laughs>